Hi, my name is Ijoma Njaka. I'm a real estate agent in Los Angeles, California. I work on the west side, mainly Mar Vista, Venice Beach, Santa Monica, Culver City, all the fabulous areas. And today we are going to see some homes with Megan, one of my clients. And I actually sold her this beautiful home two years ago. Alright, so here we are at my client Megan's house. I'm going to pick her up and go view some homes and possibly list this one so I have all the paperwork just in case. Are you going in? I'm good. So I've got a camera here today. We're going to do mind if we do some stupid. No, okay, that's great. <laughs> yeah, I did my hair. <laughs> oh, you look fabulous. She always looks fabulous. That's why. Um, this is Megan. This is Megan's home. Okay. And um, come on in. So this is Megan's home, and she totally fixed it up from when she purchased it a couple of years ago. She did a great job, and now we're going to go find something even better, but we've got some pictures for you so you can see what a great job she did. So this is home we're going to go see today. It's not it's far. Like, it's like, <laughs> I, I wasn't going to say anything, but yes. I wasn't planning totally on having it recorded, so mm -hmm. as you can tell, no yard work. So Megan has dogs. Yeah. Uh, good point when you're selling your home. <laughs> Clean up the dog shit. So, yes. So this is the home that we're going to go see today. They don't have dogs, oh. I happen to know. Hopefully That's it won't good. smell like dog shit. Uh, three bedroom, two bath. Nice. It's on the market for a million eight. A million eight ninety five, actually. Okay. And I think that is perfect for you. Nice. So, can we go Let's see go it? Check it out. All Absolutely. Right. Go. Let's go. Let's get out of this stinky backyard. <laughs> yeah. well, the couple's getting divorced, so those are always great times to go shopping because they have to sell. <laughs> and figure out which one is in control. That's the one you talk to. But be really, really, really nice to the other one because that's the one that doesn't want to sell. I try to be available with my clients 24 seven. So all my clients have my email, my cell phone, my business phone. You can call me anytime. If I'm available, I'll answer you. I'll shoot you an email back. Even if I need to pull over the side of the road, if I'm not available, I just won't answer. It's as simple as that. It's really hard for me not to take sides with divorcing couples because I usually, especially the wife, I usually can kind of empathize with what she's going through. The key is to not to let either one of them know that you're taking sides because you can totally sabotage the whole transaction. So just a lot of, I understand, but both of them, I understand you're not taking any sides, but in your heart, you totally take sides. So when you're working with a divorcing couple, especially as a female agent, well, I guess men probably have the opposite. You have to be very careful that you don't make the wife feel like you like the husband too much and you also have to be careful not to be overly friendly with the husband because they're kind of in a vulnerable place so you just have to be as professional as possible keep the emotion out of it a lot of I understand what you're going through so it's kind of funny because divorcing couples like to treat your real estate agent like you're the therapist so i find out a little bit more about most divorcing couples than i'd like to know but trust me they are oh so happy to tell me all the reasons why they're getting divorced makes the job kind of fun actually <laughs> that's a nice little touch Just these. Yeah. Got the listing, yay! <laughs> Thanks for coming along with me today. My name's Ijoma, and I'll see you later on For Sale by Divorce. That's all. I saw you again.